alfalfa in the seeding year is very low production, while corn silage produces a lot. So a lot of farmers are starting to produce just corn monoculture because they lose almost like a year with alfalfa in the field. But alfalfa is a fantastic crop. It's the queen of the, of the crops because it fixes nitrogen, it's a perennial. It does a lot of good things to the soil. So if we can get alfalfa established while growing corn, by the next year, the, the alfalfa is already established alfalfa. This system, we are planting both crops at the same time. Both the corn and the alfalfa are Roundup ready. So you can use glyphosate throughout the season. Where we didn't use the leafhopper resistant variety, we had to spray for leafhoppers, otherwise the alfalfa would completely defoliate and lose all their leaves. When you have alfalfa in between the corn, it is a lot of competition. Alfalfa uses a lot of water. It is very likely corn yield, the grain yield, will decrease. We've seen 30 bushels of loss in yield. But then next year you gain about two and a half tons of alfalfa. Now we're hoping that with the 60 inch corn, we're gonna get a better established alfalfa and maybe not as much reduction on the corn yield as we saw with the other one and hopefully with the same benefits to the soil.